YouTube, what is going on? It is Mesa Sean back at it from PlanetDestiny.com, your guide to the Destiny universe. And we are doing a Spirit Bloom loot chest run. And you could also get a lot of other things accomplished. So, fire up patrol, go to Venus, break left, and you want to go to the Ember Caves. Now, as you're watching the gameplay in the background, wherever I shoot my just simply delicious last word, just got it the other day. This thing is my favorite gun by far right now. Uh, everywhere I shoot or go into a cave, that is where I either found loot chests or spirit blooms. Now, spirit blooms, you could spot these things a mile away. Very, very easy. Not like helium filaments where you need a magnifying glass sometimes to find them. But where I'm pointing right now, again, where I shoot is where I found a loot chest at some point or spirit bloom. So just take out these guys here and we're going to go venture into all these caves. So let's get into a couple things to make this more beneficial to you. And now it's going to be a circular route just like the helium fillet run and you're going to do it over and over and over and if you have the bounty that's going to lead me into bounties always bring bounties with you especially if it's like uh, precision headshots or the 10 fallen ultra majors you can knock that 10 fallen out really quickly because at the end of the circle there's always going to be one fallen i think it's a captain or something like that but it counts as an ultra or a major kill and I always recommend, don't go farming for these types of things if all of a sudden you see that you need it. If you get that bounty that comes up that says Patrol Venus, just instantly go here. Because you will just not even realize how many spirit blooms you collect over time by doing this every time that bounty comes up. So make sure you get those bounties in. Also to make this worth your while, bring some ether seeds with you because in this entire circular area it's going to be all fallen. So ether seeds, as you don't already know, which I'm sure everybody does, it will extract extra glimmer out of kills. Now this group of enemies that spawns out to my right, or right here, is wonderful for the bounty. We gotta kill three enemies with the super. They just keep spawning out of the cave to the right here, and you could get that really, really quickly. Someone posted a video saying that this spot right here is like loot cave point three point six point two, whatever it is. Um, I don't think so. Actually, there's a loot chest. I spotted one underneath there. Um, that group, uh, you will get some engrams as you do this over and over, but I've never gotten a purple, never even gotten a blue there. Just greens. However, the loot chests in this uh, particular run are pretty profitable in terms of giving you some gear, especially if you're low level and you need to get some green gear. Really not going to get anything blue, I don't think. And uh, see the Spirit Bloom? They're just so easy to spot. Just look for those. I'm not going to point all those out. This is really more for the chests. In this area, three patrol missions will spawn in this area. So once again, knock those out. Add some uh, rep to your either faction or the Vanguard. But again, if it comes up that it wants you to go out of the area to go scan something, just abandon it. Go on to the next one and they'll eventually respawn again it just has to give you some time but you could just continue on farming looking for your chests and spirit blooms and then those patrol missions will then respawn in again now another great thing about this area is also public events will spawn in this area so really great for sometimes getting ascendant shards or ascendant energy depending on if uh, <laughs> you feel lucky that day but also there is that bounty where you need to complete three gold tier uh, public events so great place to get them you usually find a lot of other people in the area farming along with you so uh, every time I've been here pretty much a public event has spawned in here and I've had people with me to take it out and get that gold tier and if you're interested in learning about this last word beautiful exotic link will be in the description for a review I did here on planetdestiny.com go check it out and guys I understand that <laughs> a lot of these review vids don't have all the upgrades but you know it takes a very long time to upgrade the exotics but also if you go to my channel there's a telemetry video I'll link in the description on how to level up your exotics really really fast so here we're coming to the end that's where that captain is and he'll respawn over and over actually him and his buddies will respawn over and over to the right part of you here so we are coming to the end of the run. There's really nothing back down here. It just goes into a whole other area that would go for a story or a strike or so forth. Don't worry, really worried about it. Sometimes some chests can spawn up here, and of course there is one right here, but I gotta make sure I blow up that thing. You know how many times I've died <laughs> blowing that stupid thing up? Get your chest, and then there's a few more falling down here, and then to your right, there's gonna be one more cave, and that's gonna officially end the run. So you can see there's just so many caves to choose from, and uh, you do this over and over. I'd say you spend an hour in here, you'll get a zillion spirit blooms. And you'll knock out patrols, you'll knock out bounties, and so forth. Like here, I'm just finishing up my docking caps one, and that'll be it. So that's the last cave. I did see someone post in a video that to my right of me, up on those cliffs up there, they did spot one at some point. I don't know. I haven't seen one, or <laughs> I never actually tried to look up there. But here we are coming right back to the beginning, and this is where you would just start the run all over again. 
Once again, guys, I am Mesa Sean. My links will be in the description, so come on over and check me out. I'm actually going to be doing an Elgato Game Capture HD giveaway sometime in the next week, so come on over, say hello to me. Make sure you keep it locked in here. Smash that subscribe button and like button at planetdestiny.com, where we are the guide to your Destiny universe. That's it for me. You guys stay beautiful, Guardians.